Some time back, uh, a good friend of mine on Facebook had asked me to write a song for autism, and uh, I didn't know much about it. I didn't know really how to approach that. Uh, she has two twin sons that, that deal with this every day, and so I, uh, you know, I kind of sat on it for about a year. I, I didn't really know what else to do. And one morning, I woke up, and I had these lyrics kind of dancing in my head, uh, especially the first two lines of the song. Uh, so I got up and wrote those down and thought, hey, these, this would be great for that autism song I was supposed to write a year ago. Uh, so I did. I sat there all day. I started getting online and doing some research and, and trying to figure out really what autism was about, what the, the children and the parents and, and everyone kind of goes through during that. Uh, so I was able to put the song together uh, that day. And it turned out really well as far as I was concerned. And so the next day, I woke up, went to my studio, kind of did a really rough recording of it, and sent it to her. And she sends me an email back and said she'd been crying and her husband was crying. And, and it really, you know, how was I able to, to really speak for these autistic children? And so I thought, wow, you know, I'm really on to something here. So um, long story short, we knew that we had to record this. So we went to Nashville and put together our team when we were doing the record. We knew that this song had to be on there. We knew that it could touch lives all over the world and, and hopefully one day become an anthem, really, for autism. And uh, given part of the proceeds that we have to uh, local autism charities and that kind of thing, uh, we knew that it would reach out to families all around the world, and we hope that it does.